charming. Um, earliest Christmas memory. Um, good, a long time ago, I remember we we used to have the Christmas tree in the sitting room and next to the fireplace was a nice big footprint left by Santa with the ashes from the fire from the night before. Being in the Panto, being in the Panto. Or, I suppose, um, a where was a Lourdes trip with uh, the Clonfort Diocese, so that was great. Yeah, all, all my cousins, my parents, all friends, everyone in America. Happy Christmas, have a good year. Joseph Ward, um, from Joe Ward Menswear in Main Street in Ballinasloe. The earliest Christmas memory was getting a Cadbury selection box and I still ask for one every single year and yet I am 42 and I don't care <laughs> I still definitely order one at this day without a shadow of a doubt and it has to be Cadbury's too just to let you know um, best memory of this year uh, has I think it was well, it had to be the opening we had a, a launch there on the 29th of October um, we had more people in the store on at that weekend than any Christmas that we've had over the last maybe 14, 15 years, which was an absolutely fantastic result for us. And the amount of help that went into us, the amount of effort that was done, and the amount of, um, we basically, and we got everything in Manaslow for it as well, which made the weekend even better. Um, I've got the, uh, yes, I would love to wish happy Christmas to um, my wife, Grace, my uh, three amazing kids, um, Alexander, Dominic, and Olivia. Uh, Mum and Dad, um, without whom this pla this uh, place wouldn't have been possible. And then uh, the rest of my family and all of their kids, and especially to all of our customers and to Balance Low itself, because it's been a fantastic year and I can't wait for next year. Yeah. Um, my earliest Christmas memory was getting uh, an, uh, a nurse's outfit, uh, which was very funny really because eventually I did become uh, a nurse and that was from a very young age. Life of 2022 for me was my son um, is in Australia and um, we hadn't seen him in almost three years and with Covid and everything. So uh, he came home uh, for six weeks during the summer and that was a really exciting time for all of us. Um, I'd like to say a very happy Christmas to my son Niall who is in Melbourne and just to wish him a very happy Christmas. Probably my little sister being born, she was born on the 23rd of December when I was four. But this year it's just life getting back to normal. Just everybody hope you have a happy, safe, peaceful Christmas. Uh, Councillor Michael Connolly. I suppose there were a number of highlights during the year but predominantly uh, one of the big things that came, I'm, I represent uh, Banas Law Electoral Area and Galway County Council on the BACD, and uh, they have made considerable strides in several uh, items of funding. They got 600,000 at one stage during the year, and no later than this morning they've got uh, 250,000, and that's predominantly to promote uh, remote working, the 250,000. Is and uh, you know, the BACD does an awful lot of work, voluntary work, on behalf of the Bandeslow area and its environs and the community. And very often they're just working away and beavering away down there. So I think it's important to highlight that they have been extremely successful in uh, Lynn and the team have been very successful in getting funding uh, for the Bandeslow area. And I think it's very, very important that uh, you know that, that they are acknowledged and recognised.